Hello Minecrafters, it's Simcraft here again and we're in uh, Simcraft world. Um, on the other uh, video I was showing you how to roll back uh, grievers um, but if you don't um, put in all the details like uh, the radius it only does uh, a certain area but if you want all this uh, clear I'm going to show you how, how it's done. F but uh, first, of all, first of all we'll show you to find out who, who did it and then and then we can uh, roll back that person. Um, Sony was uh, trying to build something in creative here. I don't think they finished yet, but they'll come back. Uh, if you click on that, oh, see, oh, I just grieved it off. It's enabled now. That was Ol Oliver Poon. So he was the creative builder, but somebody came along and uh, they, um, he just, Cody Ball. Okay, Cody Fireball and another person, Urba Beast. We're going to get rid of all this uh, in one go now by doing a, something like a hundred um, block radius. Okay, here we go. We go C O Roll. Oh. Uh, this is Core Protect, by the way. Uh, C O Core Protect. Uh, but you go C O. It's short for core protect. CO roll back. And if you know the user, just put the new user's name. But you can just do it by time and then radius. But um, I'm going to do it by user to see uh, the people that did it. Uh, let's go with uh, B's. Just got to spell it right. And the time, let's say, he put it to uh, say three hours ago. So we do the time, say five hours. But you don't want to, uh, you don't want to do it more than five hours because the other person built about ten hours ago. If you did it twenty hours, then you get rid of the creative builder as well. You don't want that. Anyway, we're going to do five hours, but we're going to do a radius of say a hundred uh, blocks and see what happens. There you are, a hundred blocks. That's much better, isn't it? It uh, gets rid of the whole area. Um, if it doesn't get rid of all the bits and pieces, a uh, quick method that also be useful is get sponge and you can mop up, look. Oh, look, you have to put off uh, put off uh, inspector, uh, call protect inspector, you mop it all up. There you go, it's all mopped up. And then, um, uh, Let's do this area as well. Oh, this is a different. So as you can see, that was um, the one griever. This is the other griever. So if I went C O inspect again, inspect that and um, click that. You can't see, but I think you saw before it was a different person. Actually, a method. If you can't see, because the source was probably up there, and you can't actually look. You can see Oliver's spoon. He's all right. It's, it's this. Just put a block in there, I think. I think you put a block in. Um, let's have to switch off CO inspect first. Put your. You can actually put a block where the source is. I think. And then you can click on that. Click CO inspect. If you know where the source was. Um, I don't think this is going to work because. Oh, it is! Lava placed. It didn't say the name, but if you put the, you put the say you put the lava on here, we just switch off inspector again. You should be able to find who did it from there. I'll get rid of this in a bit. Cause it's a bit like um, me grieving somebody else's bill, but I'm not going to grieve. I'm just going to try and find out. Go C O inspect. And uh, if you can imagine, say, lava being put here, then you could find no blocks. Oh, it's probably broken the the wall. Anyway, I know who the person was anyway, because I've written it down. Uh, it's because I was getting rid of this area, but uh, that sometimes works. You just um, want to find out who placed the lava. There, th there you are. Did you see that there? I just took out um, his name. 
so he placed that there and there was another person that placed the lava as well there you are, you just keep clicking on the areas to see who placed what there he's placed water as well, can you see that? water and lava so let's get rid of all this now uh, so you go CO uh, we'll just do a, a time now we'll just I'll show you the other method just if you know who they are you find out who they are and you just want to get rid of it quickly you don't put their name you can go uh, CO rollback uh, I think it's time let's call it five hours as well and then we call it a radius of say 100 and see what happens there Oh, it doesn't get doesn't got rid of all that as well. I don't know why, but as I said, you can um, you can always uh, mop up. So I hope that's uh, useful. Um, what I'm going to do, I'll take some uh, screenshots um, while while the call protect comes up and gives the actual name of the person, and uh, then I'll I'll put the ban on them. Uh, whatever reputation they've got, and then they find it dif more difficult to uh, join other servers then. There. There we are. Let's go in. Oh, there's another, another method somebody... Uh, it's... get rid of it now. What was it? Um, I think it's um, with editor. Um, it's something like mop up or something. Um, you could look that up. You can actually mop the area up, absorb it somehow. Um, I can't remember what it was though. Uh, world edit, I think. You can world edit it out uh, quickly. Uh, can't quite think what it is. If um, if I can remember what it is, I'll put it in the description below what um, you can do. But um, in the meanwhile, I'm going to just uh, clean the area with um, with a sponge. It's quick enough, especially if you've got rid of most, most of the, the grieving anyway. There you go, it's nearly all gone. I'll keep going until this is uh, all gone, I'll show you that it will disappear. Um, uh, anybody else has got uh, quicker methods than this? Um, and uh, to get rid of it all, it doesn't seem to always pick it all up for some reason. There you are. It's all going quiet now. I can hear one more little bump. No, it's gone, I think. Just over there. So, we'll leave the person with his build. Intact. There you are, look. It uh, actually, when I rolled back, I think it got rid of my um, uh, my uh, little. Well, it wasn't grieving. It was just um, trying to find out. You actually put a block in there, but I think he might have put the blocks right up there, and it's uh, grieved his whole um, build. There you go. Not much to go now. There we are, it's all gone. And what was there? There was um, uh, a little uh, water thing. There you are. It was. Uh, oh, how many and that shows you how many people actually. I put these to the trucks to show how many people come into my uh, um, self tester bill. Oh, oh I'll just grieve my own then. There we are, I'll just get rid of that. Get it all cleared up for the next people to come in. Um, as you can see, this is the main world, and you come in first of all. And if you add your Minecraft name and age on one of the signposts, you can uh, do a self-build uh, test yourself into Creative. And the pass mark is uh, seven eight to ten. It's high, but you can just try your best. And then I'll I'll put the I'll put the warp here. So you can see where it is. And what I had, I had a little um, 
because you can't see it uh, like um, the nether um, portals I put that there it looks like a portal then and then I don't think the person put his name on here so I think he's actually just building something upwards um, it's probably one of the uh, mobs or himself and he's just he's just done the legs so he'll probably come back to finish it sometime okay I hope that helps um, this is Simcraft and happy minecrafting uh, let's get through it bye for now bye